particular time, he, he thought I uh, uh, would be okay doing it. And so he, he was very supportive. How long did you have to shoot it? I, I shot it in five weeks, four and a half weeks, five weeks. Yeah. Uh, not long. It cost about $700,000 uh, to make that. And, and that uh, probably, maybe if you put on some overhead, they might have pushed it up to uh, 800000 but something like that. Mm -hmm. And uh, and were they pleased? I mean, besides its, it's box office success, were they pleased with the result? Uh, I think they were. I think that, I think Universal was hoping I'd do a western and three or four cop dramas as as repayment for doing it. But uh, I just started going out and doing different things, and uh, uh, I was looking to do. I was looking to not get married to a, a certain genre. Mm -hmm. I, I wanted to uh, do films of all kinds, like they did in the old days. Like the films I grew up with in the 30s and 40s, actors would play in all kinds of films. And uh, that's, uh, that versatility is what I wanted for myself. Mm -hmm. You also, uh, in Play Misty, got to indulge, uh, in, but in a very uh, natural and appropriate way, your love of jazz. Uh, you set it against the Monterey Jazz Festival, uh, and uh, Errol Garner's piano playing in that scene playing the composition. And, uh, and that's something that has followed you all these years of music. Yeah, I, I've always loved music, and, I, and uh, it was always named Play Missy for me. And, and uh, Universal wanted to change it to something that they owned because they didn't own that song, but I convinced them that that song was a, the only song at that particular time that crossed a lot of generations because rock and roll was coming in and that sort of thing, but, uh, but I needed a ballad, a, a romantic song that would cross for the younger generation as well as the older generation. And Errol Garner, of course, was a wonderful piano player, great talent. Did you ever play with him? Did you ever know him? No, no I, I, I wouldn't have that much nerve. <laughs> but he was, a, he, was a, he was a great guy, and, and, uh, and, and uh, we, we had him back in to re-record for Liz Springs and all that sort of thing. The, uh, uh, your 